Hey there everybody, this is Bigwigs, and welcome to Volgar the Viking. Now, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to spell that right, because it has one of those O's with two dots in it, so whatever. Um, this is a game that's I've actually seen on someone else's channel and stuff, so it's it's a game I know I already like, but just came out today, just came out like 45 minutes ago on Steam. And it's it, it's been described, and I agree, as like a 2D Dark Souls. And so we're just gonna do like the first hour of it and just see how it goes. This is a hammer. I have no idea how to throw those. Okay. I don't know how to do anything. Uh, oh, up and attack to throw spears. That's how you do it. So with this game, one of the cool things you can do is throw spears and the spears can be used as jumping platforms. So that's always a nice thing to do. And down and roll, let's do that. So, this is, as you can see, it's definitely 2D. The difficulty is something I'm... The difficulty is something I'm not sure on. But um, as you can see, whenever you get hit, you lose like a piece of your armor. And every time you get hit, your armor actually does constitute some sort of like benefit. So if I lose my shield, then I can no longer block certain projectile attacks. If I lose my, uh... Well, I know the shield's the only thing that showed up, but as you can see when I first picked up that first power-up, because we do have power-ups in this game. Alright, so when I pick up power-ups, I gain certain... Basically, it's called the special abilities, and I die instantly. It's to be expected. So I pick up this shield, my spears will gain a charge effect. So I can actually hold and charge up my uh, weapon, my spears, and they'll actually go through enemies. And of course, I think do maybe twice as much damage. Swords tend to instantly kill people. Get the fuck out of here. My house. Now, when you jump, it's interesting, you have to choose where you want to jump. I mean, when I mean choose where I jump, like, I can't control myself in midair. I control, like, the direction I throw, but that's all I can do. Left button where to, like, sort of look at the map a bit more. And it just goes in by itself. And I tie again. This game is... I believe when they were showing off at PAX, they were saying, like, no one could beat the first cell in, like, the hour in which we showed it. I'm gonna try and do it, like, because, like I said, I've, I've seen it done before. I feel really bad because I, I kind of wish I didn't. It made the game a little bit more interesting, but, you know. It, it was basically a no-brainer when it came up, like, on sale today for me. I guess that was that's sort of the upside to it. We actually crouch, and our shield does block things, by the way. It's not just for show. Oh shit. Of course it doesn't block things when I do that, but, you know. And we can no longer charge up our spears, we can still throw them normally. There's plant things going on. And I have no I don't have a timer on me, how am I supposed to know when an hour's up? One moment, let me go grab a phone. Ah, we're right back, it's just over on the table there. What time we got? 1.54. Let's see what we can do. So we'll just continue on. With the game. I'm hoping to beat the first boss. It's entirely possible. This is the part where you use things to do things. Yes, things to do things. Excellent commentary. So if we actually come down here, we can throw a spear like that and do that. So there's like pre-recorded like areas where you can throw spears and where spears work and don't work. It's all it's all entirely based on what your height is. All right, we'll jump up there, because like I said, I don't have... Come to me, gold! Damn it. I don't have, like, a... A set distance of where I... I, don't, I can't control where I jump, so when I, I have to commit to a, uh, a direction before I do anything. And when you double jump, you do a little sonic spin move. Ah! Oh. And we're back here. There, there are checkpoints, but it's basically, like, at the end of the level. And then you get to the end of the level. And we'll just do this. There are saves in this game? 
There's rumors that there wasn't, but there is. You get like a different ending though, if you don't beat the game all in one go. And it's been said that, hey, this game can be beaten like in an hour, like under an hour. But so can Dark Souls, actually. Ooh. If you guys didn't know that, Dark Souls is gonna be beaten in under an hour. You wouldn't know that if you've ever seen my channel. Ah, oh, lose the shield for no good reason. Whoop. Let's just keep throwing the stuff. So, like I said, shield basically like your lives. It's sort of like being a Super Mario Brothers esque. Ooh, didn't know that I could do that. Ah, uh, there we go. No, there we don't go. Hey, hey, there we go. We got the spider then. Just come over here. Yeah, it might be smart just to do that. Throw the spear up there, or not. <laughs> excellent way to die there, Big Wigs. Excellent way to die. So apparently, Volgar can't even walk up like the smallest of um, things either. And I apologize if this video is going to get a little bit boring. But just me doing this over and over again. That's how the game works. That's how Dark Souls works as well. The only reason. Well, I say the only reason why. Basically, there's going to be all the stuff in Dark Souls that I usually edit out. It's just all going to be right on here. Oh, no! Okay, didn't lose my shield. Hey, watch yourself. And boom! Ah! Oh. Oop! We lost our shield again. It's fine. We might get another one back. So we do start with a wooden shield, but when we get that other metal, yeah, I'll show it when I, we get the other metal shield. Go. Gold is just like a score based thing. Balls! <laughs> when you double jump, I think you have to choose a direction then. So you can see right now we have a wooden shield. Wooden shields do deteriorate over time. But we pick up this, the hammer shield, it turns metallic and it's basically invulnerable. This. Basically, I can take a bunch of hits, like right to the face. Of course, maybe not right to the face. Let's see if we can show it off on the snake. I'm pretty sure you can block snake shots. <laughs> Scrub Lord. Yeah, we'll see if we can show it off. If we crouch down. Yeah, see, we block shots. With a wooden shield, it slowly deteriorates. Oh. Oh ho ho! I'm using. Keep trying to use analog stick. Come on, B. There we go. Charge up the shots. There we go. Fire blast. And we'll just slice up this mofo. It's no match. Go, try and get. There we go. I know the gold doesn't matter too much, but I'm, I'm, I have an issue basically. Let's just do that. Shit. And we're basically screwed now. No! Oh. And maybe that'll be enough. God. Oh, we're getting to this part now. No! Oh, ho, ho, ho. clutch! All right, we got our wooden shield back. We don't get metal shield right away because we lost our shield. What the flower dude now. Flower power dude. I don't like flower power dude. I think if we just do this. No! No! Oh, I'm alive! No! Oh! <laughs> I'm a fucking idiot. I was like, no. I died and I didn't. I had forgotten the shield. 
still gives you that extra life. Mad loot? I'm not getting the mad loot. There are points where enemies do infinitely respawn. And those parts are just moments where you have to run away. Just crouch down here. There we go. Some enemies actually can't, like, hit downwards, so... So it's actually a good idea to usually crouch and attack in some cases. It's weird, when you charge up the spear... I'm not using D-pad. I need to use D-pad, that way... It's like, when you let everything go, it doesn't go, so you have to, like, tap it again. Whoop. There we go. So it's it's a little bit weird to charge up. Oh no, you just you just press up and it holds down. Okay, okay. I can do with that. Ba ba b. All right. Looks like we got this nailed. Oh no! Balls! Oh, I hate you so much, spider. Okay, so we're back to Flower Powder Man. Oh, no, that sucks so much. Ooh, get out of there. Don't jump up here. Get away. I want to kill Flower Powder Man. Oh, no, Flower Power Man. Why? I'll try to get past the first checkpoint in this hour. But no promises. No promises at all. Lizard men! My favorite of men. It's not being racist or anything to other men, but... Get out of here. Oh, no. No. We, we've run out of our shield, and that mainly means we don't have any more lives. I'm gonna call them lives, you know, not too much what we get. Dude, 96, that's pretty good. There we go. I really like the function of platforming with spears. It's a very interesting idea. Let's do this. Alright, there we go. It's like thinking with portals, but instead you're thinking with horrible Viking spears. Ah, oh, shit. There we go. We got our shield back. I remember this means I can take another hit. Oh, flower powder. Okay, we're, we're taking care of Flower Power Man. Oh, yeah. We didn't need this money at all. But it makes us feel good. Killing shit feels good. Oh, fuck you. Denied! LeBron James! Out of my house! No! Ah, oh, bye bye, spider. Platforming junk. Okay. We're actually gonna wait. There we go. Oh shit. I don't feel good about this at all. Actually, this is actually a perfect spot. Oop, as long as we, because the spears do block Flower Power Man's things. So we just wait here. And we got it. Oh yeah, son. I forget what's coming up this part, because that's bad, but we do have shield power. Oh, the double jump! Oh no. Don't do this to me, come on! Last one! Checkpoints! 
By the way, the game's looking a little bit frame rating. Like, it's not even at 30, but at the same time... <laughs> oh my god. That was the lamest thing in the world. We're actually doing better now, though, because we have a shield. There you go. This introduces arrow traps. I'm not sure how I feel about arrow traps. Actually, that's not sure. I know how I feel about arrow traps. Oh, we got the shield. Thank God. No! Fuck you! Oh, no. Not like this. Do that, because as you can see, there's a little slit there. We can roll. And everything's gonna be fine. No, it's not. Oh. Don't do this. Don't do me like this game. I'm, I'm making it so far in my second try in this area. Nope, 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 nope. Oh. There we go. Fucking red lizard man. And fuck you, spider. I'm scared of more enemies spawning. Oh. We're getting really far now. Like, arrow types. Now, the shield on my back will block those arrow shots. Like I said, the wooden shield deteriorates. So, we just want to, like, slide past them. As soon as they're done shooting, that way our shield stays in tip-top performance. Now, if I if I remember what I saw in that video, this is one of those areas. Oh, this bullshit! You know this bullshit game. No! I was gonna LeBron James him again. Hey, we got pretty damn far though. Oh, yeah. We can get that good shield again. That's all we need. Ooh. All right. Oh, come on. My good shield. So you can't get like, there's like five different levels of equipment. Like, even past what I'm on right now, so. We'll just do that. Woo oh. oh, There's like five different levels of equipment that I went past. I think one's like a fire shield. Oh no, after the big important uh, super shield, the charge spear throw, it's uh, a helmet, which gives you an extra hit. Then it's like a fire sword. Woo -hoo. No! -hoo. No! -hoo. Oh. Can make that? No. I can make that for sure. Oh, yeah. <gasps> Alright, we got past that arrow trap. With a whole shield thing left. That's very good for enemies that we're going to get them up to. And we'll just slide past these arrow traps. Take three hits on that. One, two, five is the magical number. Dude. Oh, this is bullshit! <sighs> Keep forgetting they can hit me like that. There we go. I like the double I like how your double jump though is a attack as well. It makes my life so much easier. There we go. Keep! Do that quickly! Alright, so we are just continuing on with this game. Or if you'd like to see more of this, be sure to uh, literally just watch this video. And if it's any good, I'll make more. 
That's what my channel's at right now. Oh, four hits on that guy. Oh. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, trick on him. Attacked at his weakest point. His ankles. His Achilles heel. His, his Achilles heel is his, uh, his infeminate ankles. <gasps> Can we get fire sword here? No, we get helmet here. That's right. That's an extra hit, though. Sorry, let me demonstrate with this. They are traps. Boom! Blocked by the shield. Blocked by the shield. Blocked by the shield. Oh, I forgot to let go again. Oh, ho. I remembered it that time. Oh, come on. Do that. Get the secret. <gasps> Fire sword? Fire sword. Double damage with sword. Oh, no. No. That could have been so much better than getting hit twice there. I'm waiting for the snake to come back so I can just slice it up. I'm gonna run for it. All right, just come up here. And if we just do this, it actually unlocks a little bit of a secret for us. No fall damage in this game. There we go. Like I said, spears block the dude's thing. This is still sort of like a tutorial mode, believe it. Oh, I just didn't see the arrow trap. God damn it. Fuck you, snakes. Fuck you, snakes. I keep forgetting I can actually, uh... I can't block air traps with this shield. There's no reason for... There we go. That makes it a little bit scarier at all. We'll throw a spear there. We're getting... We're a well-oiled machine now when it comes to this area. We got this. Am I forgetting anything? Am I gonna be... Fold wrong immediately. All right, we got this. Well, the machine. Oh, there we go. Oh no, I'm a well oiled machine. A well oiled machine. I just broke. Fucking lizards. The red lizards, dude. Apparently, if I throw spears, my face touches them. That's just... Fuck my life. Sometimes. God, just make up the rope! Oh, well. I usually lose my shield anyways for it. Whoop. Got my spears, got my rolling. And my bees. We'll wait. Come on. Not much has changed in my strategy. Though, even if I have lost that invulnerability shield. Because, like I said, my, my strategy is to just survive. Let me move the cord out of the way real quick before I, like, yank it out. Like, the worst possible way po- We're actually gonna aggro this motherfucker all the way over here. Okay. We got this. Gotta remember that's where I had to aggro that guy, or else I'll be, uh, maybe not killed instantly, but it'll be bad. Take that, mofos! There we go. What's over here? I forget. Oh, these guys. Oh! 
Four. Fuck. Fuck me. Got past that area once. I can do it again, though. Don't tell me I can. I will beat this air level boss once I finally meet him. Gotta remember, D-pad's just better at this point in the game. I keep switching over to analog stick, though. Maybe I shouldn't worry about it too much, though. All right. Pro parkour master here. This game should just be my absolute best game ever because it's Dark Souls mixed with a 2D platformer. There's no reason for me not just to be amazing at it. Because it's like all I have on my channel. I'm trying to do more about that, by the way. Oh, I just killed it without really thinking about it. We aggro, like I said, aggro this mofo all the way over here. Oh, blocked it! Oh, yeah! This. And we got a helmet. Boom, helmet. Oh, don't lose my helmet now. Roll, roll. Roll your Viking. I keep forgetting. Jump up here, jump up there. Get out of here! Run! Get the helmet back! Oh, another extra hit. Oh, no. Oh, nope! Stay there. There we go. So we still have our good shield. We still have... That's all we have, really, is the good shield. We still have the charge throws. I'm not sure how that's going to work out in the long run. But it's going to work out better than all the other times. Because we died last time. We shouldn't die this time, though, because I know there's arrow traps. Boom, arrow trap. Okay, so we gotta be extra cautious. Okay, I remember this part. I remember this part. <laughs> this part was such bullshit. So, as you can see, it'll do that. No! Why would you stand up? Oh, I just exploded. Oh, it records time there for me. That's pretty nice, Flit. Okay. Be cool. Get my shield hammer. Much better placement of spears. <gasps> nope! Ah! <laughs> that was like the worst moment of my, of my life. Okay. So we, we fucked that up royally. I'm not gonna lie about that. I should be doing so much better than what I did there. Bye bye, arrows. Slash at you. And we'll just continue on. Ooh. Too bad, Red Lizard Man. Too, too bad. Fucking flower power. Fuck you guys. Oh, do spears have range? I kind of... I have expected Volgar just to throw spears infinitely. Maybe that's asking too much. No! Why am I so bad? Because I'm rushing that area. I'm getting cocky. I'm like, oh, I've done this area, like, so many times before. I can do it so easily now. But you can't! 
It's just like Dark Souls. And by the way, a lot of games seem to be like saying, oh, it's just like Dark Souls because it's difficult. I mean, yeah, sure, Dark Souls is difficult, but it's not difficult just from being like bullshit. It's difficult because of that's just how careful you have to be. Oh, LeBron James! Oh, yeah! Blocked you, mofo. This is my house. I'm not even sure if that's a good reference or not. It's just what I say whenever I manage to block people, like in basketball or something. It might be, it might be just like the wrong person to quote. There you go. We got our shield back. We would have loved to have the hammer instead. But if we play our cards right, then we can do something freaky fresh here. Okay, we get something freaky fresh here. We got the helmet, that's what we got. All right, so we'll come down here. Oh, dude. Okay, steady. Oh. So when you roll, you end up facing backwards the way you pointed. That's undoubtedly going to be super relevant later. So I need to remember to do that. In fact, if I roll under those spears, those top first ones, then I will be facing behind me and still crouch down for the other set. So, it should be quite good. Also, I have a helmet. I should be able to get by with my shield. So, things are... We're doing better already, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Or I can I can just totally scumbag this whole process. <laughs> Fuck walking, dude. Oh, dude! Fire sword. Oh. Dude, this game. This is getting epic. Don't fuck it up here, though. Alright, so just be cool. Two hits on that guy. I think this is the boss! I remember how to kill the- I remember how to kill the boss. It's just... <laughs> I remember how to do all these areas, but it doesn't mean it's gonna be, like, possible. walk over here. We'll wait for him to do the power smash. Alright, we'll come over here. We'll wait for his power smash again. Oh, my f flaming shield's gone. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Don't do me like this, boss. Oh, Oh, power smash his face. Oh no. Oh, thank you so much, shield. Oh, and I cut off his head. First try on the boss that I've seen done before. Aren't I kind of a scumbag? Let's not do this in 22 minutes. Is that really how long it's been? I feel like I should end the, the video here, but I said, you know, first hour. Yeah, it's, I mean, we got we got about another 20 minutes. There was something else I saw that was really cool about this game. What is it? Oh, I was gonna try it. If you, like, land on it from a very high height. If you land on it from a very high height. Ah, screw it. 
Apparently you could like somehow magically do stuff. But let's just continue on with this level. I've actually seen a bit of the first area like this too. And these guys are just absolute bullshit assholes. So we'll just continue on through this little uh, water level. The water world. Oh, we got our health back. And we'll base just kick ass, take names. Alrighty then. And we're doing we're doing fairly well so far, I think. We're we're actually doing really well in this area too because I've seen it before. I need to stop saying that. I'm, I'm this game's tough. Like I've seen so many of these parts before. I'm still like screwing up massively. I say that we get the fire sword again. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna go through this whole area just one time and just rot its world. Oh, the reason I like those guys is because they seem to just have like. Oh, ho, ho, thank you, God of whoever controls this game, Norse God, I would imagine. Alright, so Norse God of Volgar the Viking. I love you. I guess is what this. Oh, fuck you, Norse God of Volgar the Viking. I didn't know those. Was... I wanted to keep my flame sword, but, you know, helmet is still very good. It's very much a thing that I want. I think this is a crab boss? You just wait here and let him do that. No! I shouldn't have jumped! Fuck you. Right. I'm on a boat. Well, I was on a boat for a little while. Let's just jump back in. With this level. I did very good that last level. It might have been because I was, uh... Like I said, when you know what you're doing, this game, it's like Dark Souls. If you've seen it before, then you know it. Slicey, slicey. But enemy placement's quite interesting. It's supposed to be a bit like a tutorial. So, like when uh, certain enemies show up, it's like, oh, that's a very easy spot for me to shoot, like hit that thing. And then, hey, it even explodes another enemy, so I know, hey, when those things die, they take damage. Oh, no! Even the crab boss was relatively easy. There we go. Those blue guys, that shows very clearly, hey, this when you like tag this guy, he just jumps in the air. This guy as well. I mean, it's just, hey, he slides. But I can do downward smack on him. And we got our helmet back. Always nice when you got two hits away from death instead of just the one. Always nice when you have two, it's away from losing your shield, too. Ooh. I'm trying to avoid sword swinging those green ones, because they do have just a little bit more range than me. There we go. And there we go again. And we'll use my double jump spin tactic. At least we don't need to use double jump spin tactic. We can just regular jump and attack. We'll get this box. We got regular shield back. That's one more head away from death. That's very important. Because I'm not doing as good as I should be doing. Now, if we double jump and regular jump and do this, then we can do it without taking damage. Sorry about that, one of the cords that sprawled all over in front of me leads up to my mic, and if I, like, lay my controller on it for too long, then I just sort of stop doing it. It stops working. And I just ate some meat and some chicken. That's badass, Vulgar. 
Make the jump. Okay. All right, we got this chest. Oh, all right, so that guy's dead. We'd like to kill that guy too. Oh yeah, we're doing good now. No! Why? So we'll just jump up here. We'll do this all over again. We got a little bit farther though. We know what to expect. Ba ba mofo. Slash at you. Exploderize that. All right, we'll do some of this. Some of that, some jump tosses, some jump throws. We'll just start kicking ass again. That's all we have to do. That's all you have to do in this game, you guys. You just have to kick ass. All right. Slash at your chest. By the way, if this is a little bit over, a little bit under an hour, apologies in advance. Yeah. You know. Oh, sorry, buddy. Get away from me, frogs. Nobody loves you! Oh. Come on. Yeah. Doing some of this, doing some of We'll get Flame Sword here. Unless we fuck it up somehow. I hope we don't, though. I just want to get this game. Flame Sword! I'll wipe. Parkour my way through that. this. With the flame sword, things are looking up. <laughs> All right. That's taken care of. Now we fucked it up. Oh. Yeah, we fucked it up pretty bad with that one. We still have our shield, though. Flame sword's gone, but... Oh. Well, there goes our shield. Oh, I threw instead of jumped. A fraction of a farther away. That's... That was painful to do. That was such a bad thing. Just be good. There we go. Slice at you, mofo. Destroy that which destroys him. Come on. And then we'll... There we go. Doing all sorts of good shit now. We'll get our super shield back. Kill this guy. We gotta stay calm and kill the red guys. All right. Logo the Viking will not let us down if we don't screw up so much. Okay. Bye-bye. 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 Bye bye. Easy. There we go. See, it's easy, big waves. You got this. You're about to get the helmet again. We'll just wait for this guy to pop up. Throw some spears. Get the helmet. Two hits away from death now. That's good. We're on the crab dude. We got the crab dude. So. Set. All right. 
Rip in peace, crab dude. And this part should also not be difficult. Right, flame sword on. Ooh, shit. Shit. Much better. <laughs> the shield. Oh. Do this to me. No! Oh, the crab! Let's check the time here. 2.37. One or two more good runs, and that'll be the end of the video. But it's so close, I can taste it. So close, I can taste it. Slice at you. Slide down here. Do that. Kills that guy. Alright. Oh, yes. Kill you. This first area, I think I got down, to be honest, you guys. I think I got hook line. Just got the helmets. We're, we're going to flawless it this time. Ooh. That was close. No. Fuck. That wasn't flawless. I'm going to be honest there, guys. I'm not sure if you noticed, but I took a bit of a... Bit of a hit to the face there. But it's fine, you know. Flame sword is nice. It looks pretty damn cool. But with enemies like we're facing now, damage isn't really the problem. Everything seems to die in about one hit, and there's no way for us to really make our spears that much stronger. Unless for some sort of uh, tier of equipment I'm not familiar with yet. Which is totally possible, by the way. So we dealt with the crab. We dealt with that. And we're on this part. Alright, so. Oh shit! No! And you know what? I have no idea when I actually started doing this, but I think we'll end the video there. You guys like this? Well, click the like button. I was going to say, well, I don't care. I liked it, so I'm going to keep playing. That's all. So, thank you guys for watching. Have a nice day, and goodbye.